here we are going to solve this problem. Uh, the question is assume that x is normally distributed with mean equal to 15 and standard deviation equal to 2. Now we are given some relationship from this we can we have to find the value of x. Now in this question x is the random variable. And the random variable is approximated to mean 15 and standard deviation sigma as 2. Now we have to find p of x greater than x equal to 0 0.5. Now we are converting into z variable. So we can write it as p of x minus mu by sigma greater than x minus 15 divided by 2 which is 0 0.5. So, P of Z greater than X minus 15 divided by 2 equal to 0 0.5. So, 1 minus P of Z less than X minus 15 by 2 equal to 0 0.5. So, by simplifying this, we may get P of Z less than X minus 15 by 2 equal to 1 minus 0 0.5 which is equal to 0 0.5. And from Z table, x minus 15 by 2 equal to 0 when z equal to 0 0.5. So by simplifying this we may get x equal to 15. Hence the value of x is 15. Then come to the second part. In the second part we have to answer <coughs> p of x greater than x equal to 0 0.95. So which implies p of x minus mu by sigma greater than x minus 15 divided by 2 equal to 0 0.95. So, P of Z greater than x minus 15 by 2 equal to 0 0.95. Hence, 1 minus P of Z less than x minus 15 by 2 equal to 0 0.95. So, P of Z, great, Z less than x minus 15 by 2 equal to 1 minus 0 0.95 which is 0 0.05 and from the table that is from the z table we can have x minus 15 by 2 is equal to which is equal to minus 1.6 so x equal to 2 times minus 1.6 plus 15 which is equal to 15 minus 3.2 which is equal to 12.8 it is 11.8 hence x equal to 11.8 and third one we have to find p of x less than x less than 10 which is equal to 0. So from this we have to find x. So which implies p of x minus 15 divided by 2 less than x minus mu by sigma less, less than 10 minus 15 by 2 equal to 0. So from this we can write this as P of x minus 15 by 2 less than x minus mu by sigma less than and the value of this is minus 2.5 equal to 0. So this one can be written as P of this one we can replace it as z. So z less than minus 2.5 minus P of z less than x minus 15 by 2 equal to 0. And the value of this from the normal table is 0 0.00621 minus p of z less than x minus 15 by 2 equal to 0. Hence, p of z less than x minus 15 by 2 equal to 0 0.00621. And from this, we can have x minus 15 by 2 equal to minus 2.5. So, x equal to 15 minus 2 times 2.5 which is equal to 10. Hence, the value of x is 10 here. Then, fourth one, we have to find p of minus x less than x minus 10 less than x 
which is equal to 0.95. Now take y equal to x minus 10. So we can write as p of minus x less than y less than x equal to 0.95 and which implies p of y less than x minus p of y less than minus x equal to 0.95. So p of y less than x minus this one can be written as 1 minus p of y less than x equal to 0.95. So twice p of y less than x minus 1 equal to 0.95. So by simplifying this we may get it as p of y less than x equal to 1.95 divided by 2 which is 0.975. So now we have to convert into normal variable. So now replace for y. So it is x minus 10 less than x equal to 0.975. So p of x is less than bring this 10 to the right side. You will get x plus 10 equal to 0.975. Now we have to convert into random uh, z variable. So x minus mu by sigma less than x plus 10 minus 15 divided by 2 equal to 0.975. So p of z less than x minus uh, 5 divided by 2 equal to 0.975. It is 1.96. So x minus 5 by 2 equal to 1.96. So x equal to 5 plus 2 times 1.96 which is equal to 8.92. Hence x equal to 8.92. Now we will verify this. P of minus 8.92 less than x minus 10 less than 8.92 equal to 0.95. So by adding uh, 10 on both sides we will get 1.08 less than x less than 18.92 equal to 0.95 and the condition is satisfied. Next last one we have to show that p of minus x less than x minus 10 less than x equal to 0.99 by simplifying in the above uh, in the same method as above we will get twice p of y less than x equal to 0.99 so p of y less than x equal to 0. Uh, it is 1.99 so 1.99 divided by 2 which is 0.995 so substitute for y so x minus 10 less than x equal to 0.995 so now bring this uh, 10 to the right side so you'll get p of x less than x plus 10 equal to 0.995 Hence, P of x minus mu by sigma less than x plus 10 minus 15 divided by 2 equal to 0.995. So, P of z less than x minus 5 by 2 equal to 0.995. So, x minus 5 by 2 equal to 2.58. x equal to 5 plus 2 times 2.58 which is equal to 9.16. So like the last one we can verify here also.